This is Bob Collects Stamps, and I'm Bob. Here is a content warning for this particular video. It does discuss the historically enslaved peoples of an African country. Sao Tome and Principi issued this stamp in 1996, featuring an Atlantic sailfish. As I said in the previous video, there is one other species of sailfish in the Pacific and Indian Oceans. Sao Tome and Principe is a country comprised of two main islands, Sao Tome and Principe. The country is the smallest Portuguese-speaking country in the world and the second smallest country in Africa. The islands were uninhabited when found by the Portuguese around 1470. They were settled by Europeans beginning in 1493. Sugar became a large crop on the island with the help of enslaved mainland Africans. Until 1515, however, they were not able to produce sugar for export. The islands did, however, become active as a hub for transporting slaves to Portugal and Spanish-speaking colonies in the Americas. The treatment of Africans on the islands was mixed, and in 1517 the original male slaves were freed, and in 1520 some freed mulattoes were allowed to hold public office. However, the transport of enslaved Africans through the islands was continuing. Portugal abolished slavery formally in 1876, but the local practice of forced paid labor continued, and this type of slavery essentially did not stop on the islands until the 1950s. There were few willing European colonists throughout the history of the islands, so the islands were initially used as a penal colony, and for deported Jews. Sao Tome and Principe gained independence from Portugal in 1975 and has been a multi-party democracy for most of that time since 1990.